My name is Steve Cassing. I'm the inventor of the Duckfoot. The Duckfoot is a slipover paddle tine that goes over the existing tine on combine headers to help reduce cutter bar losses and feed the combine more evenly. We put a reusable clip system on the top that is quick and easy to put on and take off. Any type of farmer can benefit from using the Duckfoot. We use it in all varieties of crops. You can gain a half a mile an hour, three quarters mile an hour. That's big in a 12, 14 hour day. Duckfoot is made out of high quality nylon six plastic. It's all UV protected. It's rated for minus 40 to plus 85 degrees Celsius. Everything is made in Canada and we buy our plastic out of the US. I'm proud of the Duckfoot because I created it for my own farm, found good benefits with it, and now I'm able to share that with other farmers. I'm here today with Sean Edwards of Edwards Acres in the Comus. Sean has been one of our original demo guys and using duck feet for four years. How many acres do you think you got on the duck feet? Uh, it will be pretty close to 15,000 or a little better on the original ones we've got on. Do you have an original one with you? I do. There's one here? still on the header, so we can, can have a look so at we'll it? pop it off and have a look at it here. There's the original dock foot. Uh, As you can see, there's really no wear on it at all. I'll hand you one of our new ones. So there's the new one side by side. So we run them in peas, lentils, wheat, barley, canola, uh, pretty much everything we grow up here. We run them on, we don't take them off for anything. You used them in soybeans as well? We used them in soybeans as well, yeah. What advantages do you think you found with the duck feed in some of those crops? Uh, definitely keeps the knife cleaner. Uh, cereal crops, you can run your reel higher, so you're not feeding it with uh, pipes. You're actually feeding it with the duck feet, yeah. uh, which is definitely definitely more efficient. Lays it flatter on the header, yeah. and uh, feeds better. Around here, we've had some pretty short soybean crops in the past, so you know we can get down, we can get every pod, we can get them flipped up with the duck feet and fed in across the knife without uh, without knocking the pods off. Whereas before, with the straight fingers. Uh, lots of pods were dropping off under the knife because we just couldn't get them into the header. If you want more information on Duckfoot, just head to our website, duckfootparts.ca. If it doesn't say Duckfoot on the paddle, it's not a Duckfoot.